out the indies, man. We're helping out the indies. What can we do? Where can we put wrestling to continue wrestling I for the it. sake of wrestling? Do it. I got it. On a lake. On a lake. There On was... a lake. That's there... what I want. You, you get a giant ass. You get a giant ass like um, um, piece that you put in the middle of the lake that's weighed down heavily by weights and properly constructed and everything. There's a mm-hmm. ring that's a part of it. Mm-hmm. Everyone is taken out to the ring on jet skis. Okay. I'm with you. Um, all, all the fans in attendance are in giant inflatable tubes. Tubing? Yes, this is what I want. Um, <laughs> and and um, you call it um, Lake Ness Wrestling. Ooh. Ooh, hey. that's good. That's good. That's good. Wrestling on a pontoon. Pon- P- pontoon Palooza? No, that's... Yeah, that's... Pontoon Palooza, no, sure. that's, that's just a boat sail promotion. Uh, bash at the buoys. Bash at the buoys. I like this. <laughs> I like these ideas. Anybody else want to go? Anybody else? Anybody else? I was going. I was thinking. Um, <laughs> hold on, hold on. And I, and I, and I, Bobby said, oh. "I would not, could not on a lake. I would not, could not call it fake." <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I had to get that in while it was timely. Great work, well Bobby. <laughs> Yeah. Go ahead, Rob. I, I was, I was, I was thinking, and and I even mentioned, you know, we probably talked about it at the time uh, when we did that Hilltopolis thing a couple of years ago, mm-hmm. like whatever park that was, where it was like overlooking the city uh, to where the the city was yes. in the background of yes. every shot. Grandview Park. That, it like, was, it was this, um, it was this this concert that was put together by by the guys I work with up in up in Allentown here in Pittsburgh. And yeah, it was amazing. We it was a live stream thing. We were even internet in the park, and they pulled internet in for us. And we streamed this thing. And what was the cool kids were headlining, right? And uh, yeah, plus they had people talking and stuff yeah. before that. Where I was the one shooting out, you know, down over that, you know, that angle the whole time. And I remember even when I'm just like shooting people at the podium talking. Yeah, yeah. It's like holy shit, you can see a lot just in the background. Oh yes, <laughs> with the the, yes. the city to where it's like that would look awesome is like a backdrop for a, a show especially as the, t- the time of day changed and you know mm-hmm, mm-hmm. lights so, come on and so like you that. you want it up in grandview park overlooking the city or just yeah like a place like that you I, know i'm sure every city kind of has one probably I, th- I think the closest to that and it wasn't filmed uh, but rise did one down at that um music fest at um uh right highmark field uh that that you uh-huh. look across and say that would be a cool place to do like more of a wrestling show too, um, it, mm-hmm. it, in different contexts, of course. So, uh, also backup. We're still on this lake thing, by the way. Uh, Tina says that that was already done. <laughs> Lex Luger by <laughs> slamming Luke Zuna on Fourth of July. That yes, Tina, Tina's yeah. responding to Dave, who said Helicarrier. Oh, okay, okay, I see. Yeah. Basically, <laughs> Dave is going into the MCU for this one. Okay, and Tina yeah. thinks that the Intrepid can fly. <laughs> okay, I I'm <laughs> okay with all of these i'm with that i if she told me that i believe her so Mm -hmm. we don't know that it can't no no we don't no we don't we don't we don't there there could be be a repulsor (laughs) beam in the hall we'd never know Mm -hmm. uh tony matt do you have any uh um ideas for this that you'd like to see do we get do we take all the good ones i know i know you know we always um Mm -hmm. we always pipe dream about heinz field here in pittsburgh yes and um, shooting the fireworks off the tops of the buildings in yes. downtown Pittsburgh is amazing. Super beautiful mm-hmm. draft backdrop. Now, Heinz Field might be a little bit of a, you know, a tall order. That's a big stadium, but there's a smaller venue uh, up the river a little bit, Heinz Stadium, for our Rinky Dink soccer team plays. And um, you basically get the same effect. You yeah. get you know small mm-hmm. you know football field size stadium much more smaller seating capacity, same backdrop of giant buildings to shoot fireworks off of. Mm-hmm. It's basically all we're looking for is something to shoot the fireworks off of. Yeah. And uh, yeah. they look real yeah. nice going up the tops of those buildings in downtown Pittsburgh. So, That's right. Uh, I'm all about the backdrop. It doesn't really matter where yeah. we are. So, <laughs> Plus the smaller, like if it's a scale, yeah, like smaller stadium, it just takes that, that much less to fill it and make that look full. There you go. Yep. So... I, I think high mark is probably my favorite answer of all of them uh, because it's the one that like, if you know anything about uh, the owner of uh, the river hounds, he's actually from Connellsville. Hmm. So, uh, which is right near RWA slash rise territory. Mm-hmm. Um, so 
um, Tuffy, if you are listening to this, and I don't know why you would be, but if someone wants to send this to Tuffy, who is the owner of uh, the River Hounds, um, I know some people. There you go. So, but, uh, you know, selfishly, my backyard, because I have a, a nice <laughs> acre, uh, unselfishly, um, I think a, a cornfield that we would hollow out for a ring and we would just give very, <laughs> very vague directions to it. And if you find it, you can watch. What and if you time? can't find it, the rage in the maze. What, what about? What about old timey wrestlers just appearing out of the, <laughs> yeah. out of the field? If you, and, <laughs> and we have run ins where they come directly from yeah. the cornfield. Yeah. Like, oh, I love it. Yeah. I love it. The Ring of Dreams. Yeah. It, 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 it would be the Ring of Dreams. Have, it would be the Ring of Dreams. That's the one where you yeah. can have all your legendary wrestlers just wrestle. Just get yeah. them all there. Yeah. Like, every, like, no one under 45. It's a lot to be yeah. at that show. If, yeah. if, you show, if you show up to that show, you can watch it live. And if not, you can watch it on IndieWrestling.us, yes. seven-day free trial. <laughs> exactly. Oh, uh, tagline, tagline, if you build it, they will fight. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Um, I, see, I like I, I like where, you're, where your head's at. Um, I, you can yeah. take that into a further extreme. You got to do the speakeasy wrestling event where you mm-hmm. find a venue and you do zero yep. advertising, <laughs> and you basically it becomes like the secret that you tell everybody. You know, uh-huh. come back. that was basically so that, Vir- that, Virgil yeah. would still end up there somehow, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. That was basically yeah, how yeah. Alter Bar did all their concerts when I was a kid. Like no advertising, and you would just show up, and the concert would be there, and you didn't know who was playing. Sometimes it was a dinky band. Sometimes Fall Out Boy would show up, and you're like just like, oh, "Oh wow, okay." <laughs> I, but, I, I like this idea. I you know so. There was um, uh, talking with Glenn Spector and uh, and Potter last week on on the Indie Mayhem show, and reading the Devil Budokan book. I was not aware, uh, gentleman Joe Perry, who actually just passed in in recent weeks here in Pittsburgh. Uh, May he rest in peace, a legend. Absolutely, uh, but he ran these outlaw shows in the late '90s, early 2000s, which were not. I, I guess they weren't state commissioned. They, it, and it was basically that effect. <laughs> it was the secret shows, and all the wrestlers showed up. And the right people know the right people know some fans mm-hmm. will show up. You, you'll, you'll get paid. Uh, but I, I think that was part of like, you'll, you'll still get paid no matter what. And it was just another thing for people to like the wrestlers to have a chance to wrestle and, ha- you know, grow and, 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 and do that whole thing. Um, like this is like a piece of Pittsburgh history. I was not aware of, you know, these, these secret shows, but with like, pretty legitimate names as far as like just people in pittsburgh wrestling right um so like, like that's kind of the speakeasy wrestling isn't it and this was like in penn hills or something i think they were doing this so sounds like it, 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 it probably saving oh, all the money by not paying the commission so yeah so yeah it's probably a good deal here's what you do <laughs> you have the speakeasy the front of the speakeasy be a vhs rental store and you call the store tape traders Oh Ooh. wow! We just bringing it back, man. Bringing it yeah. back. That, that, because those who know know, and they'll be like, "Hmm, let me mosey on Can, into this VHS store." Even though I don't have a VACR, let's see. That's weird. <laughs> a copy of UK Rampage '96 on '92 on its side. Pull. There's a ring. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can we? And then I convert all of the shows to DVD. Okay, got it, got it. Because yeah, I'm not dealing with so, dubbing you VHSs. You have to deconvert them. You have to deconvert them to VHS. Oh, I'm not doing that. And I actually really love this uh, from Arlene in the chat room. Oh! Since Allegheny, since Allegheny County pools will be closed this summer, drain a pool, <laughs> set up a ring, and have oh my God, wait. balls sitting around the edge of the pool, dangling their legs. <sighs> I oh, sort of wow. it. I <laughs> sort. Yes. Mineral Beach here in the South Hills of Pittsburgh. It's this old, like, I don't know if it used to be a wave pool or what, but it is drained and it is empty. The weeds are already growing in. This place will do anything. I, that, that is the spot right there. Oh, that is man. a RWA pool. presents. Matt, that was, exa- that was exactly where I was thinking because we drive past it all the time to go to South Hills Village. So yeah. that is exactly where I was thinking. I Clear the weeds out. We, uh, you know, we make a pitch perfect riff off joke oh, to yeah. bring in the younger ah, crowd. Yes. It's perfect. Well, it, it, in a Kendrick. Call the show. The 
RWA presents the deep end. Let's do that. Take it, yep, Derek. Off the deep Take end, it. yeah. Off the deep end? Oh, oh, that's so good. Still feel bad. That's it. That's it. All right. Well, I think we've uh, solved all the problems of professional wrestling in, in the Pennsylvania area <laughs> yeah. with this segment. I'm glad You're to see welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. an abandoned pool. I'm going to cut this out. I'm going to cut out this clip, and I'm going to tag every promotion in the area.